hello 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 welcome to another episode of bubble tea's gaming and i was struggling to think of a topic to do the video but then you guys helped me out cause like from the day the long night event came out to now at least eight people have messaged me what legion skill should i get i have xx and i need this this that that blah. so i thought once and for all i'll just do another video and you guys watch it and you guys decipher for yourself okay so I kind of disappointed like that like people do actually have to ask but like you need to try an error but on the other hand I understand getting this and the skill to decent like 8, 7 or 9 it takes a lot of money so people want to be extra sure but guys if you know something is right and you know something is good just try it out if you're unsure ask but I think because of the cost, people are a bit like hesitant to pull the gun, so I'm here to help you guys out. If you notice, I haven't really answered anyone directly because I really want people to think for themselves, but on the other hand, I also realize that, hey, it's, it's money and people need to be extra sure. Okay, without further ado, here is Notepad 2020. I, I feel that this is... I'm so annoyed, man. Uh, let's see whether I can help you guys out. Eh, no, 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 shit. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, uh, let me small learn it. Okay, is this alright? Yeah, okay, looks cool on my end. So, what are the Legion skills that we are gonna pair? Oh, wait, wait, let me see whether I can do this in a nicer uh, metal hood. Wait, uh, give me a minute. Okay. Okay, I, I just thought of using tier list maker, but apparently it's gonna take a lot more effort, so like, hey. Uh, do you guys want me to actually use the tier list maker? Cause I feel that that's gonna take me a while though. Okay, for the next uh, long night event, I will actually use the tier list maker. For now, let's review the skill. Okay, so. Uh, on on my other uh, document, I'm gonna just put down all the skills listed. So you get Dragon Strong Assault. Okay, so I'm not gonna list them, I'm just gonna do it as we go. So Dragon Strong Assault, total attack. Uh, Dragon Follow Up, total attack. Dragon Reinforcement. Uh, Calf Infantry Spear. Reroute Legion Defense. Legion Damage. Uh, uh, Legion Survival, Legion Attack Bonus, Legion Defense Bonus, uh, uh, Army Counter Counter, Building Defense. Okay, it's not that actually much though. So like, okay, so without further ado, this is the first one you should get. No matter what role you get, Legion Reinforcement currently at 330. It's on discount. This, if you're thinking of getting a red skill, don't get reroute. Get this. It's because like it gives you 60k army size. Okay, so how much is 60k army size in the game? So if you want to see this, 60k army size is about a premium skin uh passive, like this. So look at this. Uh, keep keep of kings. So they give you army size and rally size. So in theory, you need three premium skins to give you 60k army size. I'm just doing a rough gauge. So you can imagine getting this even at the deer event, which there's three now. It's also about 400 to 500 bucks though. 400, 500 bucks times five. Look, you're looking at the bonus of 1005 collective bonus of a premium skin. Not accounting for the active bonus uh, is about 750. So Legion Reinforcement basically gives you $750 worth of stuff. So you get my logic, right? Like, like there's very hard things to compare army size because like you only get it from your leadership and your commander damage. And the one thing good about Legion uh, Reinforcement, Legion Reinforcement, that is that you can have any number in a rally. So if you show me your screenshot and I don't see Legion reinforcement in your uh, uh, current dragon, just get it, man. It's okay. So to to emphasize how busted is this? Let's say you have six million, uh, six point two million rally, 
and the red leader is 1.2 million and you got 5 million more and if your alliance is disciplined enough and each member sends exactly H uh, 600k uh, army to the rally you're eventually getting like wait 6 8 uh, 6 times 8 yeah 8 8 times 60 okay Ooh, let me see Ooh, 48 4800 and K more uh, uh, rally size plus the original guy's own uh, legion reinforcement 540k so for his rally size effectively 1.6.2 million to a phantom 6.7 just because like every one of you has this skill inside okay so this is the number one most important skill tier to have and this is the godlike tier if you guys have the time you guys can make a tier list maker and uh, get this in there but uh, bubble tees is uh, straight to the point and uh, it's not gonna take time making a tier list maker so so retarded man okay number two is reroute okay so this one everyone knows is a uh, reroute because you're you're effectively reducing a lot of troops from there so this is definitely number second so a lot of people get stuck here they like have hey i have reinforcement at reroute what's the number three four five six okay so let's look at let, i'm gonna off my notepad for a while let's look at this uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Dragon follow up skill, 12 attack. Uh, Dragon strong assault, 12 attack. So, Legion damage is 12 attack as well. So, in order to look at a skill, right? Unless the skill has like ridiculously, like, uh, very busted. Like, most busted uh, passive have like uh, defense as a uh, attribute. The rest, they are okay, that, but uh, really good have total uh, attack. So, what is the number three? Number three is uh, depending. Wait, 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 let me pull this up. Number three is definitely rally size. But hey, ask yourself this. Ha have you ever, in the past six months, how many times have you realistically rallied a player? If it's only one or two, this skill is not for you. But if you're a banner, it's the same concept as like the first uh, Legion reinforcement. You get 480k, but in this rally size, you get 410. So it's about the same and it's necessary for UC and stuff though. But this is only for banner and uh, just banner, banner, just banner. Okay, if you're not this right, look at the scale. So your reroute is total attack. Okay, your army skill, uh, unfortunately, if it's total attack, this will be really busted. It's total defense. Okay, and if you look at a passive skill of a total attack, let, let me just pull it up. See, you only can uh, stack up to 36%. So what this means that in if you lead a rally, you only technically need three total attack to max out the rally uh, bonus. You get what I mean? So in your optimal 6, I suggest looking at only 3. Okay, what's the next one that I recommend? Okay, Legion Survivor and Legion Damage is uh, BS. If you're low on Merit, then you get it. Or you uh, need to Merit Hunt, then you get it. Or you need to... This one doesn't... Like, like I explain to people, like, hey, doesn't really give a shit. Like, if you just gonna make me coin more and stuff. So from my tier list, I'm going to need another uh, two more total attack to fill the, the passive. As in like, if I lead a rally and I only have outs or like my whole alliance is basically free to play or fillers, they're going to reinforce me with the troop attack, goal attack type thing. Then uh, I'm only depending on myself to save myself. So I'm going to look at specific stuff for total attack. So the next total attack here is uh, army uh, army attack bonus and dragon follow up skill and dragon strong assault. So right now dragon strong assault no one has been able to prove it but I actually like it a lot though cause like 
I've been looking at reports with Cersei and stuff, right? It actually gets retarded amount of uh, damage. So if you look for my optimal tree, like what I'm looking for, I will probably go with one Dragon Assault or Dragon Follow Up skill because I, uh, I have very strong commanders. So all this Dragon will probably complement me. So, so Dragon Assault. Okay. So this is, uh, what, what's the other one skill called? Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, okay, if you look at this dragon uh, stuff, right, if with legion reinforcement, you can get two death when you do a level 5 dragon rally. It's unheard of, man. And all my rebel camps are basically free. Like, zero death, zero wounded. So, like, I don't know what else you have to tell you that legion reinforcement is definitely more better than reroute. So, after the second skill, I'm gonna be looking at dragon strong assault and dragon follow up. Sorry guys, my mouse. So because uh, I've been noticing the Cersei like proc like a uh, max account without uh, this and a max account with this uh, the damage is actually quite significant like is uh, as it goes a, a game further down. So if you look at my notepad, in my uh, configuration, my dragon already has 3 total attack already. So I don't bother going with it. But if you're uh, like me, I would say this is the tier list ranking though. But this is conditional though. Like in a solo, this is really weak, number 3 and 4. So if you really want to play like a solo artist, I would say dragon assault is num 1 about here. And then number four would be legion uh, skill attack, Le army attack. Okay, so if you're looking at this tier list, I uh I have three from my two three four. I already have a attack, so it's maxed out already. So when I hit someone, it's already maxed out. I can go the route and just stack more to the attack, but after that, I feel that it's uh, uh, not beneficial. Then for me, my fourth one, fifth one, obviously would be the rally size because I lead rallies as well. So this would be, if you ask me like whether between dragon follow up, wait, give me, let me pause this down. Dragon follow up and dragon uh, strong assault. Dragon strong assault is better because like it's not RNG. When you get it, you know you have it. 20% active skill is insane though. So this is how would I do it? So I have three that when I join a rally is max 12. If I it's also not wrong if you wanna be a so very strong solo artist, you also have everything that has this. And for the last one you be, let me guess uh, yeah dude if i was a solo artist right this would be my configuration so legion reinforcement reroute dragon assault army attack dragon uh follow up four and five in so basically when i solo i just want to focus on the the total attack getting plus 12 percent i don't really give a shit about like the um, defense and stuff so if you really want to focus on soloing just get dragon skills with total attack man then for the last one, if you're just going to be pure soloing, get a uh, army anti-counter just to run it up. Counter. So, why, um, why army anti-counter besides like army counter? Because like, army counter, you're, you when you send a solo, you do not know whether you're going to uh, get, you're countering the front line, like in the blind. So this thing, were the benefits of 3% will not always work. But this, you're always going to be attacking with castles with 3 troops, so it will always prop. So a lot of people who message me are basically people who want to have a very strong solo. They don't really give a shit about supporting their alliance or making sure that everyone has the thing that they're supposed to say. So 
if you're asking me like if you really want a foolproof way to like like brain that way to like have a very good dragon that is purely made for solo attack just get legion reinforcement and five uh troop and five uh dragon skills with total attack though even legion damage can fill up the six slot so from your dragon alone you're getting five twelve percent you're getting sixty percent total attack so is brain dead to design a dragon though like if you want to be a very strong uh, the most people m message me just want to just like have like a very strong solo so legion reinforcement reroute dragon assault army attack follow up legion damage these are all total attack man so you just get 60 percent of total attack from your dragon and just your solos will be quite insane you can bully definitely free to play and uh, low spenders Okay, so now you get the logic and theory. I hope no people message me and they think once once you get it, it's all the same. In fact, the army attack is lower. It's not four anymore. Wait, let me just put it up. The army attack is lower. It's not four. It potentially might be six. It's it's very low on the tier because like army reduction now the game is making it really cheap so that if you get it from your dragon, it's not really that optimal. So, in fact. I will place this here. So, hey, oh shit, fuck, ah oh shit, fuck. Uh, Legion army attack. So, special effects for one, two, three, four, and five, six is stats. So I think this is the correct way to approach your dragon skill if you're looking to just be a solo artist. So. Uh, hit me up bubble teas gaming i hope you have a you hope you learn something from this though like if um people who ask me just want to have a very strong solo attack and hey this is what i think you should do this is pretty sick man 60 percent total attack from a dragon is insane all right thank you guys for watching my video take care good night